Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is part 1 of my Howrah vlog. This is my first time here in Howrah. Here I am in my mama's office. He accidentally broke his leg so we came here to see the doctor and do some official works. This is my first time in an engine coach. I was super excited. I wanted to come here from a long time but my mama never brought me because of my studies and here after he broke his legs I got the chance to come here. This is another day I am cutting the veggies so that I can make something and we will again go to Howrah to see the doctor today also. After doing half cooking we came here to brought some veggies. Actually, I wanted to show him my cooking skills. So today I will make one dish the recipe of cabbage and Don't know how will it taste Now we are going to Howla Junction and I thought like I will go to duty today about which duty I'm talking about you will see in part 2 this is another date today I again came to do the duty and here there is the railway walkway to uh, for two wheelers and four wheelers not for pedestrian and I told my mama to request them that you have to join your work so can you go from this way because um, the station and the hospital is far far away so this road was like nearer and after coming from that way we could see another view of our station not we only me this is the end of part one and in part two you will see about what duty i was talking about hello everyone welcome back to my channel this is part two of this video and today after a decade finally i am going to do the duty of my mama as his unofficial assistant I came here prepared for twice or thrice and each time they said like the sick leave is increased so we had to go home. But finally today I am going. Yeah. There was a time when I really craved for this view like how it looks like from in front of the train. So I came here to help my mama not to enjoy the view okay. So right now I am writing something for him. What I was doing here is that the guard needs to write down the departure time at every station so I cannot write on official notebook so I was writing on an extra page and later my mama will just copy it simply by checking what I have written. I quickly completed the task and now here I am just sitting and watching what he is doing like I can't do everything there are some rules like an official person only can do some things I forgot the count but maybe it's my third or fourth time here in the engine coach and each time I get the chance to see different type of settings we left the home at 7 o'clock in the morning so here I brought some boiled eggs and some breads and biscuits. I did it intentionally okay. So what a guard is supposed to do is he has to blow the horn and click on that button so that the driver of the train can understand that everything is fine i was there for the whole day so what i was supposed to do so i was just taking random videos and clicking pictures and here this train was competing against us like who can reach the station first
and here i got scolded because i was standing at the door like i said i can stand there i travel in train a lot but he was like this is not like normal train coach the engine coach is different from uh, the other coaches in the train so you shouldn't go there and who listens to whom and this view was kind of dangerous I just want to show here that these people work so hard, right, for us. After completing the duty for one train, we came back to Howrah Junction, and this aquarium is in the office of Howrah. Then, after 10 minutes, we had to go with another train. I was mesmerized by the view. This looks different from what we see from the door of a normal train coach. After coming with that train, we had to take rest for around three hours, and then we had to go back to Howrah. Within these three hours, we had to eat and take rest. And these cute fishes were in the dining area of that running room. Running room is where the guards take rest. There are two beds in this room, and uh, one toilet and one basin. That's it. Here they have arrangements of filtered water and I just saw that there is a washing machine like you can really wash your clothes even here. This is called walkie talkie. This is useless now when he used to be a good scout. He used to talk in this. Like this you can blow the horn by hands and by foots as well. So here our journey ends, we are heading towards our home, thanks for watching.